the fact that an early goal, there wasn't a ton to separate the team. What are a few of your takeaways tonight? Yeah, I thought it was a really good match. Two teams, they're fighting. And uh, it was a great crowd. It was a really good. It was, it was a, a great atmosphere that, that they contributed to the Red Army then. And I think it was a match that was even and, and back and forth. And there was chances from both sides. And um, it's just unfortunate that we were on the losing end. Obviously, the intent is to not go down six minutes, and that changes the game plan quite, quite a lot. What did you see from that point on? You know, did you just have enough chance in your mind that you could have created or finished? What did you see after that first goal? Yeah, I don't think the game plan changed much. I mean, we've been in situations where, you know, Tormenta, we conceded five minutes in and didn't change anything and fought our way back in. Um, I think it's uh, an example of maybe Tormenta struggling a little bit right now, and, and Ford is really passionately trying to keep their position on the table. But... I thought we played quite well at times, and um, just the breaks didn't go our way. And I think there was quite a few chances in the first half that we created and um, just just couldn't find the goal. They took their chance. We didn't. Obviously, having to play three games now in seven days isn't ideal towards the end of the season. You were finding a groove with your select group of players, and you're playing them. And, of course, you had to play on Tuesday. Had to shuffle the squad a bit coming into today. Not exactly ideal tonight, yeah? No, I mean, it, it, we've got a deep squad, and everybody's hungry to play, and, and uh, that, that's what's been so fun about the last run of form, that everybody is so excited to, to do well for the club. So, um, yeah, it's it's not ideal, but it's something we knew was coming, and, and you know, we I think we performed well, and just the last two results haven't gotten our way. Obviously, the one on Tuesday was pretty heavy. Did that have any effect on tonight coming in on the team? I don't think so because I think there was moments where, you know, if we made it 2-1, that game felt like it was it was going our way. Um, really, if we find an equalizer tonight, I think we had good momentum and we were fighting for each other. And it's one thing about this group is is they've been fighting all season long. You know, from the first game, you know, you're down a few goals to Lansing, but we still stay with it and keep pushing on and we believe in each other. And we have a never-say-die attitude. And, and I love that about every single one of those guys in that locker room. No, you were a week ago. You were in quite a different position than you are tonight. Now, having dropped the last two, how does the outlook move from what it was last Saturday to what it's going to be at the end of tonight? We're gonna keep keep fighting and keep working, and and we're gonna try to win every single game that we have, and and that's not gonna change. Um, there's 12 more points to play for, um, so we'll give everything we have to to pick up all 12 of those points. Now obviously, you're gonna be playing games against teams that are also in the hunt, but tonight would have been, I guess, the most important. You would say because forwards in fourth place, how are you going to be looking at these next few games knowing that you were kind of let down tonight? It's hard to tell because this league is so funny. You know, it, there's there's draws, last-minute draws and surprising wins. And so we, we can't really control that. You know, all we'll do is, is come back in tomorrow. Um, we've got a reserve game to make sure everybody's ready to play. We'll have the day off on, on Monday and then back at it a Tuesday to prepare for Tucson. Um, we, we really we enjoy the fight. And, um Frustrating we didn't pick up some points in, in June that would have changed the situation, but we're here now and we're really enjoying uh, the, the soccer that we're playing right now. You've had some pretty good results on the road, and of course for the next couple of weeks you're going to be on the road. What are you looking forward to, another road trip, find, finding success where you found it before? It's, it, being on the road, you're, you're stuck with each other, you know, so you're forced to be with each other. And, you know, we, we've got such a good culture uh, in this club. In a, what's up, little man? How's that? It's such a good culture that, you know, we kind of continue that uh, on the road. So we're excited about the prospect of being an underdog and, and fighting and, and, and trying to win every single game that we play. You've got 12 points to play for, and that's quite a bit. I mean, you're going to have two games there at the end of the season back here at home. So what, I mean, obviously you got to make that point up, but what else are you looking forward to the next week? It's just continuing to finish the season strong. I think we've had a good good uh, run of form recently, and so we're going to go out and try to continue that trend. Um Tonight's disappointing for the result, but again, everybody fought, everybody worked. Um, there was some good soccer that we played, and so that's encouraging. And, you know, I mean, the results have tapered off just a little bit here at the end, you know, the last few games. What would you maybe like to see differently that maybe you guys were doing a few weeks ago when you were on three wins in a row, five out of seven? Are there any little, little changes you might be able to see? Scoring more goals than the opponent, it's as simple as that. I mean, it's it's... Goals change games, and, you know, we, we continue to work in training on creating good chances for ourselves and, and scoring those goals, and, and that's the best part of soccer is scoring those goals. So we'll, we'll continue doing what we've been doing and, and enjoy the process. And, I mean, this is it's, – it's difficult to come in 
you know, with a whole new group of uh, guys and brand new club. It's an old club, but it's a new kind of direction. And we're patient. And it's going to take some time to, to, to continue to improve. But we're excited about that that fight. And um, we're, we're a really close-knit group of people. So, um, yeah, it's just look forward to the next next challenge.